Welcome back live to the fourth floor of the Glendale Media Center. Just a football toss or so away from uh, the University of Phoenix Stadium where tomorrow afternoon Boise State will take on Arizona in the Fiesta Bowl. Both teams had a sort of a walk through this afternoon. Coach Arson said it's kind of important to get the, a feel for the field before game day. If the field doesn't feel familiar for the Wildcats, the surrounding area certainly should. The Fiesta Bowl will be a veritable home game for the Wildcats who are just 130 miles from campus. Head coach Rich Rodriguez expects that fact to provide an advantage against the Broncos. It's comfortable for our players. Uh, we know the environment and I don't know how many bowls I've been in, 18 or 19 or so, and this is the first one I've ever had the opportunity to drive to. Boise State linebacker Corey Bell has been to a lot fewer bowl games than Rich Rod, but the Capitol graduate is savoring the experience that much more. Especially kind of experiencing different bowl games in the past. It's definitely nice being here and uh, growing up getting to see the two Fiesta Bowls happen already in 07, 2010. Uh, it's kind of like one of those things where it's kind of surreal. You didn't realize it was going to be you and uh, it's definitely awesome to be down here. Bell should see some extra playing time at safety in the Fiesta Bowl. That's because Dylan Lucart and Jeremy Iwani will not play. The good news is no Broncos have been sent home from Arizona yet for academic reasons or otherwise. That's a nice change of pace from last season. However, we did learn yesterday defensive end Matt Boson has been officially dismissed from the team. He recorded three sacks in eight games but had been suspended for violations of team rules since November 8th. Harson also said redshirt freshman defensive tackle Nick Terry intends to transfer. He hasn't been with the Broncos since September. 